Well, I had always wanted to go to the Amazon. It's the last great bastion of nature. It's so vast and so biodiverse and so rich, even in its present state where it's being whittled away and 20% you know, of it has been destroyed and another 20% of it has been degraded. Tenho o prazer de apresentar James Cameron. I had asked President Lula of Brazil to reconsider the Belamonte Dam project because the Belamonte Dam was going to be built right smack in the middle of the rainforest where it would displace 25,000 people so that they could make power. I implore the Brazilian government and President Lula to reconsider this project. I thought, I need to go down there and I need to talk to the people directly that are going to be affected. And the Amazon Watch people said, well, there's a meeting that's going to be taking place down there about the dam. And they welcomed us. They sort of got us involved. Nosso mais novo guerreiro. And of course, it was heartbreaking. You know, here were people whose lives were going to be altered irrevocably, whose communities were going to be destroyed, literally put underwater, or affected negatively as the river's flow would change. For these people, it's the end of their world as they know it. And they're reacting accordingly. They are there with their spears and their bows and arrows saying that they will fight. I'm very humble to stand here with such strong leaders who have a wealth that my world does not understand. And, you know, we made a, a commitment that day to do what we could to help, to raise consciousness about this issue. I've had this amazing experience of being invited and hosted by this area that's being ignored in this whole process of building this dam, not only the Belamonte Dam, but in fact Brazil has a plan for 60 dams all over the Amazon. It's very interesting, the parallel of what's going on here with what went on in our movie, you know, and it's one of the reasons that Jim got so uh, passionate and involved in this really pretty much right at the inception of Avatar, it was going to be an environmentally themed film. And, you know, I wound up going to Brazil and all of a sudden I was living in Avatar. This is our land! Oh, no, no, no. It's a